One, two, three. Financial technology is getting a lot of attention today, but behind every technology story are people working hard to help advisors build a better business. We're traveling across the country to meet those people and learn why they are dedicated to the success of advisors. These are the innovators. These are their stories. This is FPPAD Tech Tour. FPPAD Tech Tour is brought to you by Backstage Sponsors, InvestNet Tamarack, Orion Advisor Services, and Redtail Technology, with additional support provided by these roadie sponsors. Last year on FBPAD Tech Tour, we met with Victor Fetter at the site of the LPL Financial Campus under construction in Fort Mill, South Carolina. This year, we were invited to attend the ribbon cutting ceremony hosted by Mark Cassidy and Nikki Haley. So we took the opportunity to reconnect with Victor for a short tour and learn how the new campus will support LPL's innovation in advisor technology. Okay, well, here's the hard hat because uh, Victor. Just about a year, year and a half ago, we were outside what is this building. It was a steel structure. Indeed. And it's really neat to be able to have a follow-up to our conversation last yeah. time to close the loop on the investments that have made here in, in this building. We're glad you're here in the Carolinas. So let's do a little bit of walk and Sure. Talk. And I want to hear about your excitement that this space really offers uh, for your team and the opportunities that you're able to execute here because yeah. of what the space uh, opens up to your team collaboration. Yeah, you know, it's so it's important to us. We've made a substantial investment in our facilities here, but it's really an investment in our people. And that translates right. to the service that we provide, the innovations that we deliver every day as we support our advisors. Every, every decision here is intended to increase service and increase innovation it, for your advisors. It absolutely is. As you look at the open space, as you look at the collaborative workspaces, if you look at the, the level of engagement our team members have to collaborate on solutions, that's to help us provide better solutions for our advisors. Right. So it's important that advisors know about this. And that's why I, I jumped at the chance when sure, you invited we're glad us to, to have come. You. you know, the ribbon ceremony was a little bit earlier today it and was. we got a tour and so spaces like this that we have set up, you're inviting your teams anytime to walk through Sit details. down, have a relaxing conversation, have an intense conversation, all in the spirit of trying to help us move the ball forward. Help us put more time in an advisor's day so that they can better serve their clients. Now, we talked earlier, sometimes conversations can be contentious. <laughs> we don't agree on what the technology should do. That's right. So right here, tell me about these choice rooms. So these are choice rooms, and what you find in these small rooms is the ability for someone just to have a quiet moment to work on solving a problem. I was going uh, to the loud moment. Like or loud loud moments where you have a little bit of a larger room where somebody can come in and have a discussion right. and really work through whatever the thorny issue might be. Yeah, yeah. Again, I think that's qualitative to be able to work through some solutions, but if you, you know, sometimes things don't always go the way that you plan them to go. Um, so the ability to, to cut loose and hash it out but for a larger purpose, I, I like that. Yeah. So I could see myself using the choice rooms to do that. Well, you know, we find they're one of the frequent rooms that are used here, right? Both for those both purposes. Um, in addition, these rooms like you see here, where you can just have some couches and ability just to have small yep. groups come together yep. and, and talk about. You want to sit yeah. on the couch here? That's right. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll sit on the, we'll, we'll have a seat here. But, right, but just right. to sit here and, and have a conversation about what we're working on, or frankly, just to enjoy each other. Yep. We, we don't only work here, we live here. We spend a lot of time here in this building, and so it's designed with employees in mind. So that's when you see the amenities that we have built in here. The, the great cafeteria, the Starbucks, the health facility, the putting green, the basketball cool. court. All of it is because we want to work and have community in what we're doing. I heard that there might be a ping pong table There downstairs. is. There is. I'm going to challenge you again because uh, we, we have to catch up here. Hey, I know. We'll have to do that later. To, to close it out for me, help me paint a picture about... I'm sure this is very disruptive to build a building, to move desks. Um, things don't always go smoothly. Help me connect that with technology development for the LPL advisors. And sometimes technology doesn't always go smoothly. Yeah. And so what are you looking forward to with your team, with the environment here 
for the next stage for advisors. You know, there's a couple things in your question there. I mean, one is we built the building the way we build solutions, in a very agile way. Yeah. We've collected focus groups from our team members and feedback from them around what they wanted to have in a building and how they wanted it to better serve yeah. the work that they're doing. And that's the level of investment we've made here. The second is we wanted to build for scale. We're growing as a company. That's right. There's a lot of extra space here. There is. We're growing and we needed places that we can collaborate and where people can serve our clients in a very different way. And so you see that represented in the building here. And the expansion plans that are available here as the company continues to thrive. So advisors really should be, you know, resetting expectations and they should be looking forward to what comes from you, your team, and the collaboration that goes on. Sure, here. and investments in the space like the innovation lab that we have where we're prototyping solutions that That's are going right. to come out in the next six months, a year, two years even, things that we have on the boards that we're starting to work on or, or our advisor prototype office where we can help advisors understand how to bring technology into their office in very different ways. So I think a nice way to close it is any advisors who's watching, they're welcome anytime Absolutely. to come here and take in the culture and the experience that is here and they can see what they can do in their office absolutely and in their technology and to deliver great service for and them. we'd love so to cool. partner with them on that journey cool absolutely Victor this was really cool thanks for taking a few minutes to, to do a nice follow-up uh, do a little tour of what uh, used to be a shell of steel <laughs> spaces it was. I, I really much enjoyed it we're glad you're here